Dylan, I love you. I've never stopped loving you. And I know now I never will. I'll applaud you from afar. I want more than your applause. I won't be gone forever, Dylan. Give me something to come back to. Take some time off. I don't need time off. I'm at least a week. I'm fine. It's not a request. I'm up there waiting for you to come down the aisle. And I know you don't want to come. I know you don't want to come, but that you'll come anyway because you love me. And if I loved you, if I loved you. You, not the woman that I'm trying to make you be, not the woman that I hope you'll become, but you. If I did, I wouldn't be up there waiting for you. I would be letting you go. Any last words? Life is full of nasty shocks, and they always seem to occur when we least expect them. Whatever this next stage is, I'm ready. It's time for a new beginning. What is there for me in a world without you? Think about it. Washington knew that you had a destiny. You've had mentors like Benjamin Franklin and Thomas Jefferson, and partners like Betsy Ross and me. Our job was to carry you forward. My job is done. <laughs>